Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel, and today we're playing 1-2 cash games, buying for his games $200. Alright, here we defend against a 4 big line open, we're going to check raise flop here. Uh, for the turn, check the turn. Pots it. Uh, just going to call or do we just jam at this point? I think we actually jam here. I'm a little bit worried against an unknown against the 4x open, but... be a lot of bad rivers here, they're going to have worse hands that can call off, so I think we're going to go for check jam against a huge size. And they just snap full, we take it down. Uh, back to the 1-2 game here, so we have limp, we raise, get call. We're going to bet the flop pretty big here, given their stack size, to set up a turn jam. Not the best turn, <laughs> spades come in and it pairs the board, but stacks are super short. I'm just going to be jamming here. And they fold pretty quickly. So raise king, jack, sit on the gun, cut off three bets, flatting this time, some four betting as well. Good start, top pair. Pretty reasonable start. Alright, so half pot size, just call here. Turn the nut flush draw as well, or second nut flush draw, sorry. Let's see what we face here. Alright, $39, but like I said, pretty easy call here. It's the river where it gets a bit more interesting. We don't improve. Uh, 10 river check. So black the ace king coming in, but we also have a heart here, which isn't good. Um, box some of the two pairs. I think we're probably folding if he jams river here, but. So I am going to be rearing some two pairs myself. I'm going to have some queen jack. I'd potentially check jamming turn, but like I can have like some queen ten that had backdoor flush draw here. I can have jack ten. Um, he's going to have the ace king advantage, so that's fair to say. Um, also, if we flat a set of jacks here, we can have that here. So um, I think we just end up folding this, even if it's a bit sad. All right, ace jack here. We've got a cutoff open. Go for a defend. Block top pair, pretty good start. They've only got like 40 blinds back here as well, so they're a bit shorter. And they open to a bigger size. Uh, check, check, queen turn. Trying to get sizing here. Go for three quarters. They're a bit shorter, or we could set up like a pot and then jam while they raise, okay? Um, this line doesn't seem very bluffed, but you never know. I'm mostly worried about like a turn set of queens. I know I'm talking like very specific, but uh, I think we just call and keep the bluffs in. And then I'm probably just going to call down here, even though we really don't love this. If they're deeper and they jam like big, it's different, but plan is to call down here. Don't love having a club at this point either, or like blocking the backdoor straight draw. So a little afraid this is under bluffed, but we're going to call against the shorter stack. Has King Jack for their bluff, so they missed the gut shots. We call it off. We're Object 9 suited, get three bets, flat in position, flop the straight, huge flop. Huge flop. Uh, this would have a board too. I'm probably leaning towards a raise if they bet, and if they check, go for a bet ourselves. Hopefully, they're setting up a check raise with an overpair. So we flop the goods. Goes for raise, and yeah, I don't want a scare card to come for their overpairs. A lot of times, people won't have full tiers, so hopefully, they just have like aces, no heart, and we just have them drawing super thin. Kings, no heart, stuff like that. So we get in, they have tens with a heart while they flop a set. Ugh, running hearts. No! Oh man, what a cooler of a flop though that was in our favor. Unfortunately, it didn't work out. So, limps we raise. Uh, they start like 50 blinds deep. So they call queen 8-8. Eight, eight. Uh, leads them to us for pot. Gonna be a bit scary, but... Plan is gonna be to just call here, protect with ace clubs. Five of spades turn. Checks to us. And I think I'm going to go small on the turn to be willing to call off the jam. Starting queen x here. Check jams. Don't have an eight, please. Queen three suited. So they have a flush draw to go with the queen. Fortunately for us, they miss. And ace is scoop. Uh, here with king queen, we get check two. After they open pre, we bet flop, they call. Nine on the turn. Um, given the stack size being shallower and it's blind versus blind, I think we can be willing to bet to go with here. And then this river, yeah, we're gonna go for it. Probably about as thin as I would go. Queen Jack even would probably either check the turn or the river. Probably the turn. Leads for two, and yeah, we're in a value jam here. Targeting like a Queen Jack, Queen Eight, Pocket Jack, stuff like that. So we go for the jam. 
And they snap fully take it down. Open, get three back, just gonna be flatting. Take it to the flop. Interesting flop here. King nine eight. Or spades with a gut shot. Blocking king queen and queen jack suited. I think I might play some check raises here. So that's what we're gonna do this time. See the call? Ace on the turn. Go small on the turn here. And then I might bluff jam this river, uh, particularly on a non diamond or board pair, blocking the nuts. We also block him having like the ace king that maybe floats. He jams though, so it's going to take rid of all of our plans, but I did have some devious intentions on that river. And thank you, Stars 54. Yeah, last year was incredible. I was so happy with it. <laughs> That's when people are like, what's your goal for this year? Like, the biggest thing you usually say is like just you know keep getting better every year and like have a new highest winning year but last year's gonna be pretty tough to top not gonna lie i was uh very happy with the results limp raised the four dollars we call they call uh call another one hope this player doesn't jam oh they do we have top paired open under <laughs> oh man they call so I'm going to have to guess we're not ahead for now. The question is the 9 clean, along with the open ender. 38 to win 146. I mean, I guess we get in for the next 10. I'm not sure this is correct, but we're going to get it in. Got 3%. Okay, well, not good in that situation. This player already had the straight. Other player is king. All right. So I wasn't, I'm not 100% sure that was a good get in, but we did that time against the short stacks. All right, so player only three bets, 3% 3 over 840 hands. They go small, but uh, feeling pretty optimistic here. Sizing up compared to our normal four bet, just because their three bet's so small. Could maybe even go bigger than this, actually. Uh, but we, yeah, actually should have gone a little bigger, but still solid. Uh, Jack 10 2, going to bet the flop here. They jam, we call. Aces, ace, king, just got to fade a queen. And we do. Nice. Ace is good. Right, open ace, king, get called. Bet the ace, nine, two here. Raises min. Uh, let's see here. I think against a min raise, we're going to put in another bet. It's a little bit scary, but I think we go for a raise. 33 hands are playing 52 0, zero. We didn't do this to fold. It feels so dumb when they have two pair plus, but ace king, same hand. All right. End up chopping it up. All right. It's going to click it. It's committing versus the stack, going smaller. They jam. We call. 50 blinds effective. Has nines. Perfect spot. Just got to hold the dream here. And we do hold. Nice. Um, down here we got four bet jam or just call here. Just gonna call. This is the hard thing. A lot of bad turns. Probably should just jam this flop, honestly. Uh, checks to us. Small in the turn or check. We're gonna go small. Now this opens ourselves up to getting check raised here. Um, if we do, I think my intention will be a fold, which therefore maybe makes this bet bad. Ooh, diamonds come in, but we're jamming this one. The river second set here. All of it. And just do the full take it down. You're putting the four bet. This is going to be hijack versus small blind with kings. Let's see the call 10 10 8. Start pretty small. They call uh, five on the turn. Um, Let me think here. Gonna check and call your not an ace. They jam. We call if it doesn't have trapped aces or a ten. Ooh, they do have a ten. So sick. 
Uh, four bet pot. We flop the trips versus our over pair. So nasty. Um, here we're gonna be three betting against the big open from a short stack. Once we do this, we are committed to call a jam. They just called though. We flop a set. Good start. I'm um, actually gonna play as a check here. Get a little trappy. Um, bet's just ten. We'll call and call any river. Bet pot behind. And put them in for the rest. No, oh, set over set. Oh, we thought we were setting the bait and they were. Three bet pot SPR is super low. We just go top set versus middle set, or middle set versus top set. All right, YouTube, that wraps up another cash game video and unfortunately a losing session here for us today. So I played for six hours at 2 5 and 1 2. In the 2 5 game, 438 hands minus 1 8 6. In the 1 2 game, 1732 hands minus 4 12. Total loss minus 598. Um, always prefer to have winning sessions, but it's not too bad of damage here today. So hope you at least enjoyed the hands and the video. If you did, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you ever want to catch the live streams on Twitch, I have a link to my Twitch channel in the description below.